Good morning, everybody. It's Eric the Reptile Guy. Thank you all so much for all your your support. It's Saturday morning, sun's rising. There it is, and then, <laughs> and I'm just walking in front of my house right now, and I just wanted to thank you all again, really, and just to show you a little bit what's sparking this whole movement to um for zero extinctions. It's really super important. And I moved up here to upstate New York. I'm from Long Island. And I remember growing up as a child that um, that what happened was the uh, I loved frogs and toads. And oh, look at the sun. <laughs> um, look at it. Look at it. Just look. Just look. look. OK, so. Um, so, yeah. So all the um, the, the 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 toads and, and frogs and stuff in my neighborhood started to disappear because a lot of people were using pesticides. Um, I've been back a few years ago, didn't hear any frogs in the places we used to go to, and it's really sad. And then right across the way here, you can see there's um, it, it's a, a little it's a it's a river there, and that area right along there had a uh, kill deer, little, um, little birds, and and toads and and frogs. And I went out there, I was checking it out, and then the following week they were dredging it, and they didn't know, I guess, that they were that that things had laid their eggs, or maybe they did know. I don't know. However, this is one of the things that leads towards extinction because that those toads are actually endangered in Vermont and in Canada, and now they're a species of concern here. And they used to be so abundant um, all throughout New York State, and in some pockets, they're just they're they're becoming less and less. And so that's part of what our mission is to make sure that this doesn't happen to animals, but also to understand that the um, the actions that we take also that that affects us too because those toads, those birds, those animals are all doing a job, and they're helping keep our planet sustainable and and we are part of that and so when an animal dies or the the water quality is not good they're speaking to us and so that's why we're doing this and so i just want to just post this update and share with you that how important it is for us to come together on this and also the magazine is a regular form of communication that keeps people aware of what's going on so by getting this magazine on a regular basis it'll support the the, the regular communication and and that's what i that that's what the important thing is is that you communicate regularly you understand what to do and then you take action and so so let's do it together and let's keep going thank you so much i'm excited <laughs> see you soon bye peace <laughs>